shower of meteorite fragments that hit the city caused extensive structural damage and injured around 200 people. The epicenter of this singular atmospheric event is in the area between Monroe and Lanvale, already known for its urban and social decay. growing in one of the poorest suburbs. These are quite common and frequent natural events that happen on the planet. Cases of missing persons are increasing in the north of the city. I suggest you enter from here. No surveillance cameras means no prying eyes. Inside you'll find five men, all armed, but not to the teeth. But they certainly won't be rolling out the red carpet. Inside, you look for one man, our man. He'll be easy to recognize. He'll have a briefcase, handcuffed to his wrist. His name's Milan. He'll also have a stash of cash he stole from his boss. They won't be expecting you, but that doesn't mean you can let down your guard. I need you to be swift, silent, and above all, ready for anything. What? Ready for anything? What do you mean? This ain't no fucking picnic in the park. Everyone knows that Ivanovich's men don't go down easily. Now, I'm not expecting it to be a massacre, but I wouldn't be surprised if it was. If you get my drift. That's how we bring on the bacon. Right, Abe? Yeah, it's no problem. A massacre? What are you talking about? This was meant to be a simple robbery. That's not what we agreed on. Mark. Mark. Look at me. This wasn't the deal. Abe. These two lovebirds, Rambo here, he's a pussy, a fuckable one, I must admit, I wouldn't kick him out of bed if he farted, but he's a fucking pussy, and this bitch, she's got more balls than the two of you put together, you're not losing your grip, are you Abe? Give me a second.
you're gonna listen carefully and you're gonna go back in there and you're gonna shut your mouth and then you're gonna say thank you and you're gonna take orders. Now you can do that, can't you? You can do that, can't you? Okay, Abram. Okay. Okay. I don't believe a fucking word. You need to deal. You need to know who you're dealing with. Get in there. You enter from here, without being seen, and you're taken by surprise. As I said, these guys don't fuck about, but I'm pretty sure they don't want to take a bullet for a little heist like this. Be persuasive, and I'm sure they'll come around. Plus, you'll have Milan to help. After all, we're here to make love, not war. Right, Rambo? Yeah, and what if they should first? Yeah, it'd be the last thing they do. Once you've made the necessary introductions, you'll need to find the briefcase. I know, a simple, boring, brown briefcase. But it's a fucking precious one. What's inside the briefcase? Once you've got the briefcase, all you've got to do is to sit back, relax, and wait. Piece of cake. Wait for what? Wait for who? You'll be waiting for one of our friend Ivanovich's trusted accomplices, Petrovich. <laughs> what is it with these Eastern mafiosi? Petrovich, Ivanovich, son of a bitch. <laughs> to think, this neighborhood used to be full of car thieves and pickpockets. Now it's all Russian oligarchs and cocaine. Anyway, when you've got the briefcase, go to this address. It's an isolated safe house in one of the shittiest parts of the neighborhood where not even the scum of the earth would want to live. Once you're there, you'll wait for that bastard Petrovich. And in exchange for the briefcase, he'll give you a large bag of cash. Once I get my share, for all I care, you can fuck off to hell. And you don't want to know what's inside the briefcase, darling. Trust me. Understood? Abraham. See you later. What? You want to leave us here on foot? Yep. Come on, bro. I ain't your bro. I ain't never been your bro. I don't have bros. You do what you gotta do, and we both go our own ways. And if I were you, I'd keep an eye on this girly of yours. I wanna see something bad happen to her. Have a nice walk. Yeah, go to hell. What? I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Yeah. I'm sorry, Nick. I shouldn't have dragged you into all this. But you still have time to pull out. You find something else. Forget about it. I won't let you ruin your life again. I won't let you ruin my life again. Why don't we just leave? What are you talking about? Leave. Today. Let's leave and not look back. Money, tell me. We have nothing. Nothing. What 
hope is there for people like us? What future would we have? Look where we come from. There's no choice for people like us. Not to mention the money I owe to that son of a bitch of Fabra. If I don't pay him back, he won't stop until I'm six feet under. We have to go through with this. We have no choice. We have to go all the way down. But when we have the money, we can run away and not look back, like you said. But Jesus says something. I'm pregnant. Oh, Nick. both know the plan. Don't fuck it up. You got anything to say? Anything? Just say it now. There ain't no time for small talk once we're in that car. You understand that? Good. Follow me. So I don't gotta teach you how to use all this, do I? If I'm not careful, you might shoot yourself in the foot or blow your head off or whatever. Hey. Once I got to you, Imani, I'm dead to you, right? Okay, bro. <laughs> Once I got my money, you can die whenever. Business is business. And one last thing. You threaten Nikita again. And I kill you. <laughs> now that's more like it, Mark. <laughs> I think you just grew a big old pair of balls. You're gonna need that tonight. But there's just one thing. <sighs> it's just a job. So you can cut that macho bullshit. You're right.
everybody. Stay calm. Keep calm. That means you. You. Me too. Hey, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Give us what we want, huh? And nobody gets hurt. Now, it's safe. What the fuck, Abram? Why did you shoot him? That's more money for us. What are you going to do now, genius? We don't know even where the key is. Look at all the long faces. Bunch of old people. <laughs> That's gonna be a goddamn long night.
me. I'm freaking out, Mark's wrong. I'm freaking out. Calm down. Man, like... You saved my life today. That's what we do. We cover each other's backs. Till the end of time. Till the end of time. You have to be strong just for a couple of hours, okay? I'm scared. I'm scared of Abraham. I'm scared of myself. I'm scared for the baby. It'll be fine, okay? We leave all this behind us. Start from scratch. What if it's not possible? Think about it. What? What... What if we're stuck here? What are you talking about? What if there's no way out for us? There has to be. We can't give up. I saw her. Who? Tina. There's nobody here. It's all in your mind. You have to get rid of the pain. You have to be stronger than the pain. I'm trying, Mark. I'm really, I'm trying, but... Where are y'all at? Man, I hate that fucking son of a bitch. Let's go. I never shut up. Uh, you're right. You take a joke, and uh, you people, it's so boring. All right, let's get this out in the open, shall we, Nick? Huh? Let's have a little talk. It's your first time, huh? First time killing a man. Yeah, I thought so. That's true what they say, you know. It's, uh, you never forget the first time. Yeah, I'll never forget. First time I ever killed a man. <laughs> Christ, how could I ever forget it? I killed my daddy. <laughs> First man I ever killed was a, Yeah, he's my daddy. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, though, I'd do it again in a heartbeat. Yeah. I was 11, 11 years old. Jesus, think of that. Just a boy. And he was a vile, low-down, stingy, white trash motherfucker. And uh, sometimes I think that, you know, my sole purpose on this planet is to put him down. Do you want to stop beating on my mommy? So uh, I shot him with his own gun. Just pop! And it was a shitty gun, so he kept coming, you know. You know, they kept coming, bang. <laughs> and it kind of went on like that, you know, pop. And finally he went down, he never got back up again. And I was like, thank God, I never have to look at you again. And he's ugly, too. He looked like a politician crossed with some kind of fucking ape. But... <sighs> Funny thing is, 40 years, almost 40 years go by, you know, and I'm still haunted. I still see them when I close my eyes. They never leave you, Nick. But you can leave them.
but you gotta you gotta be strong you know you gotta you gotta look the other way close your eyes and pretend it never happened you know his life's a bitch I think you know that though I can see it I can see it in those big old eyes of yours but go on Go to the other side of the world, just get out, move on, go somewhere, go somewhere beautiful, go to the, go to the Swiss Alps, go to Tibet, go to Vegas, um, but take my advice, so, you know, don't ever forget where you come from, mm -mm. don't ever forget that, okay, alright, lecture's over. Oh, oh, hey, hey, Needler. Let her go. She'll be all right. Don't worry about it. Where are you? I'm sorry. We need to head back. So you decided? Decided what? Decided what? How you're gonna spend all your money, man? You're not a loser anymore, Mark. You're rich. I can't believe you forgot that. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna go first, all right? All right, first thing I'm gonna buy is a 1972 green Plymouth Fury. And a black Trans Am, like Burt Reynolds. Or no, fuck it, a red one. And then, and then I'm gonna buy a hundred dollar cigar and I'm gonna smoke it, drive the Trans Am to Las Vegas and I'm gonna meet the most beautiful showgirl. Fuck, fuck me, bye. The most beautiful showgirl in Las Vegas. <laughs> Man, fuck it now. Maybe I'll just you know, settle down, raise a family. Not with a showgirl, with the, someone else. But uh, I gotta, you know, cause I'm not young anymore. Like you guys, I ain't a teenager. In Las Vegas. Well, what's wrong with Vegas? That place is alive, and it's got big ass churches. I mean, you only live once. I just want to get away from here. Leave. Never come back. Amen to that. 
I've always wanted to live. Ever since I was a little girl. But you can't just leave a place like this when you want to. It traps you. Never lets you escape. And nobody cares. Nobody cares about us. Whether we live or die. What difference does it make? We're just scum. Okay. Well, I could spend hours talking to you, but five minutes is enough for me. Ah, I'm hungry. Are you really heading to that kitchen? <laughs> I'm not going to cook anything. Never followed a recipe in my whole life. Just gonna go order a pizza or some chink food. My treat. Oh yeah, one more thing. I think you know that I don't have high expectations when it comes to people. So don't even think of leaving with that briefcase. I think you know the consequences of that. Just telling you, because, you know, we're all friends. Excellent. It's nothing. You could have died. But we are still here. <gasps> what? There's somebody there. Dirtiest place I ever seen. <sighs> Mark. You never know. But I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. And what can I find there? An alien? <sighs> but don't let your gun down. I want you to go back. Forget it. Nick, listen to me. We can't risk screwing all this up. I want you to take the gun and wait for Habram next to the briefcase. All right? I'll be back before you can say cheeseburger. Cheeseburger?
listen, uh, Donna, I just, I, will you just let me, what, well, I, can I just talk, please? Just for a minute? Okay, um, I got the, I'm getting this money tomorrow, and it's gonna fix everything, so. No, I disagree with you. That, that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant at all. <sighs> Listen. He's my son. Okay, he's my son forever. Do you... Since when? What? You want me to beg, don't you? I know you do. Oh, you... You, you know what? You don't ha Donna? Fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you! Stop joking. Turn around. Slowly. Hey! Hands where I can see them.
You have to help me, Nick. Christ, Gina. Again. No, please, please, listen to me. I I need your help, and I, I need some money. Anything, anything. No, no, enough. No more money. If you want help, you know what to no. do. No, no. I can do it on my own. I, I, I want to get better. I... I need money. I need something. Look at yourself, Tina. You gotta quit that shit. Go to hell. Listen to me. Tina. I'm sorry. Go to hell! Get the fuck out of here. It's me. Open the door. Tina, open the door. Tina, open the fucking door! Christ! Tina.
Don't do that. Hey, there's somebody here. What? There's somebody here. I saw him. Oh my god, I knew it. What? That son of a bitch. Oh. Jacob. He's trying to fuck us over. I'm gonna. I swear to God, I'm gonna kill him if I see him. Well, where's Mark? They used to tell stories about this psycho Russian. Well, he's just fucked in the head, but anyways, his name was, um, Sergei. Sergei something, Rostov, Sergei. Volkov. Sergei Volkov, yeah. He built a nuclear bunker because he was convinced that they were gonna drop the bomb sooner or later. Still waiting for it to happen. Shit's still here. down there, huh? Jesus Christ, who did this to you? I mean, what the hell is going on around here? I don't understand. You go out of why you still have time. Nick, please. Hey. Hey. Take care. Out of here. We have to get him out. We have to get him out. I am a dead man. No. Fucking shit.
Hey, Nick. Come over here and look at this. Come over here and look. We got two choices, all right? We can either forget about the money and run away. Or what? Let me end this story like every other story in this scumbag neighborhood. All right, for you, Mark, and for your kid. What? You see, I got a kid too, all right, my son? He doesn't care about me. He doesn't want to see me or hear from me. I, I don't blame him. But right now, you can fix your future, okay? So let me fix this. All right, let me do just one thing right. I'm gonna go down there, I see any more of these things, I'm fucking bat for them. And then if I don't come back through that door, you're gonna stay here real calm, you're gonna wait for that son of a bitch, you're gonna grab that money and you're gonna go. You're gonna never look back. No. What do you mean, no? I'm coming with you. Well, that's out of the question. Yeah, I always like to be prepared. Babe. What? Thanks. Hey, it's all the same to me. Half the money's still mine. Never turn him back, right? Never. Looking for. I ain't got the slightest idea. Whatever it is, it's gonna be bad. Story of my life. What's the plan? What's the plan? What's the plan? We shoot the motherfuckers. Your plan is perfect. Who the hell is that? He's the man I saw. Oh, he's a dead man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, Abe! <sighs> you. I know him. Huh? He's the homeless guy. Oh, wait, wait. He's that hobo that hangs around the mission. That's Willie the whack job. What have they done to him? 
Uh, it's too late to ask him. And who are they? Oh my god. What's happening? Look! Jesus. Do it. The people in the neighborhood didn't just disappear. They ended up down here. Something drew them here, as it did us. Right. But what? These creatures seem weak. They're like babies. <laughs> we just find the mommy. We need a bigger goddamn weapon. Oh, shit. Abe, what's going on? Well, let's say it's a blackout, but... I know you won't believe me. Right. Abe? Abe? Shit. Abe? 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 Abe, where are you? Mark. Who do you think it was? That's not possible. Hey, what's wrong? Is everything okay, sweetie? Never leave me again. Until the end of time. <laughs> your mother. I was waiting for you. 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 I was waiting for you.
trying to give me a goddamn heart attack? Get that out of my face! We have to get out! We have to get out! should already be out. How is that possible? I got no idea. I have no idea, because none of this makes any sense. Something's got into our heads, Abe. What the hell are you talking about? This thing that hides here doesn't want to let us go. It needs us. If it didn't, we'd already be dead. I've 
a bitch. Right. <sighs> yeah, you gotta lose the bright side. Hmm? I'll never see the light of day again. No more shitty days. You still have a lot of work to do on your pub, ducks. You know that, right? Find my son. His name's Ernie, okay? And then when you find him, you gotta apologize. Tell him his dad is sorry for everything, okay? Why can't you do it yourself? I ain't gonna get out of here. Look at me. <laughs> Jesus, look at me, will you? What are you talking look. about? You're gonna go out. You're gonna find my son Ernie. And you're gonna keep your promise to me. You're gonna tell him that, that, that dad's very sorry for everything. Okay. I need you to keep that promise for me. Okay.
This place is a shithole. Where is Abraham? He's gone. Gone? Yeah. Is he by chance the one lying on the sofa? There's a real party atmosphere here. Okay, enough with the pleasantries. As long as that's here, everything is fine with me. Inside what? The briefcase. You're telling me you didn't open it? No. Stuff that's out of this world. 